What's up guys and welcome to another episode of Spike Reviews. So uh, I'm trying out a little bit of a different angle here. Let me know what you guys think. I'm going to roll with it for now. So I got hooked up today at work with the three brand new international flavor of M&Ms. So here they are. So I didn't even know these were coming out. They were just kind of a surprise. They just showed up at work. But uh, of course I'm the guy that reviews food and stuff on YouTube. So they gave me one of each. So huge shout out to those at work. And uh, let's dig right into them. So the first flavor is from England and it's English toffee peanut. That sounds really good. So um, I don't really eat much chocolate, but um, M&Ms are Peanut M&Ms are pretty good, so I'll make an exception. Uh, next flavor is Thai Coconut, with peanuts of course. This one sounds like it's going to be really, really good. Now for the oddball in the group, this one just threw all of these for a loop and I never thought this was going to exist, but this is Mexican Jalapeno Peanut M&Ms. Jalapeno flavored M&Ms, um, okay, yeah, that's, that's one way to branch out I guess. But, uh, I mean, it's not the first time I've seen spice mixed with chocolate because you get a lot of cayenne chocolate higher in um, cacao percentage. And it's kind of a delicacy. It's something that something that happens in the chocolate world. But uh never really seen a jalapeno flavored chocolate. I've seen jalapeno peanut brittle. That's pretty good. So I guess these are going to be good too. So let's dig right in. And I'm going to leave these for last because they they're the most interesting. So let's start with um, English toffee. Let's we got our M&M &M right here. Cheers. That's good. The toffee flavor is super strong. Almost leaning towards a little bit of uh, burnt sugar right before it burns. Very nutty, very, um, very deep, rich flavor. It almost tastes like coffee a little bit as well. So that's really, really good. If you like coffee and chocolate, this is gonna be your go-to right here. Overall, very solid. I'm gonna have to give these a seven out of 10 because the flavor is really strong and I don't see myself eating very many of these before I get really tired of the flavor. But overall, it's pretty solid, pretty good. So seven out of 10 for the uh, English toffee. Next flavor, we're gonna go with the uh, Thai coconut. So coconut and chocolate are two flavors that are really good put together. Add a little bit of crunchiness with the peanuts and this can't go wrong with this. I have a feeling I'm already gonna like it. So let's dig in. Let's not waste any time. The colors on these are really unique. See the first one I got, like a really, like a lime green. So that's pretty cool. Put the lime in the coconut. Yeah, all right, cheers. These are solid. These are really, really good. If you're a fan of coconut and chocolate, you're going to love these. As soon as you start chewing on it, you get a burst of coconut flavor, which is awesome. And then the uh, texture from the peanut kind of reminds you like you're actually eating a piece of coconut. So that's really, really cool. These are going to get a nine. Possibly my favorite out of the three for now. Now, Let's get into the crazy territory. Let's get into the weird territory right here. And uh, let's open up Mexican jalapeno peanut M&Ms. Uh, here we go. I see a yellow, green, and red for the color profile on this bag. Very bright, very colorful. Now, without further ado, is this one gonna be good or not? All right, let's see, cheers. What the fuck? Interesting. Kind of off-putting a little bit, to be honest, because... So one thing I like about all three of these flavors is that they don't taste super artificial. They taste really similar to what they're supposed to taste. Like, the flavor profiles on each one of these hits the mark. It doesn't taste... Ar ar uh, it doesn't taste overly artificial. You actually get the taste of the jalapeno on this. So you bite it, you get the chocolate, the peanut, and then in the back of your mouth, like the taste lingers of a fresh jalapeno. And it's really weird, kind of works somehow, but it's, it's a little bit off-putting because it actually tastes like a fresh jalapeno. 
So in that aspect, it doesn't mix very well. But the spiciness, slight spiciness and the chocolate mix pretty well together. So it tastes good. But just that taste of the fresh jalapeno is kind of a little bit off-putting. But not overly spicy, but enough spice so that you recognize that it's there. Uh, these, are, these are solid. I might have another one. So these are cool to try, but I don't see myself having too many of them. So I'm going to have to give it a 7, just like the English toffee. So overall, my vote goes for the Thai coconut because it was the tastiest to me, the more balanced one, and overall just straight up delicious. So there you have it, guys. The three brand new international flavors of M&M's. I believe you can go on the website and vote for your favorite flavor, and I think the winning flavor is going to stick around. So uh, go out there and try them and place your vote. I'm voting for these. It's been another episode of Spike Reviews. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Check back for more reviews, vlogs, and other random videos. So until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Hit that like button. Do it. Peace.